Howdy fellas, uh, tomorrow is the opening of squirrel season here in Tennessee, so if you haven't already, it might be a good time to drag out your charcoal burner and go over everything, make sure everything's working good. Number one, is it unloaded? Is it clean? Is the lock functioning properly? And if it's a flinter, is your flint sharp? Does it look like it's going to be able to make the gun fire? If it's a percussion, make sure your nipple's clean. And then you're going to make go through your uh, shooting bag. Make sure you have all the things that you need there. Powder measure. Extra plants. Tools to do repairs. A vent pick of some kind. I've got two in this case. I've got the set of flinters tool with the vent pick. And I also have a vent pick and pan brush that hangs on the bag as well. So I've got two there. And you want to make sure you've got ammo. And this is a bag that holds uh, your round balls to fire with. Uh, in the case of percussion, percussion caps, you got extra caps if you get your capper. Just kind of go through everything and make sure you've got the you know, patching material. Don't want to forget that. Uh, you can either use pre-cut patches, which there are some here, or you can use pillow ticking whichever you choose. But at any rate, make sure you go through your bag and make sure that you've got everything you need to make a gunfire. And if you're using cut patches, I mean, uh, pillow ticking patches, you want to make sure somewhere in that bag, if you don't pre-lube them, and like hang them off your shooting bag, you want to make sure somewhere in that bag you've got some patch lube. In this case, this is some uh, Trapper's Mink Oil that I've just repurposed a uh, musket cap can and just put some of that uh, trapper's mink oil down in there. Lube your patches with that, but you want to make sure you've got uh, patching material, patches, and all the things you need to make your gun fire. So I hope you have a great hunting season, and as always, thank you for watching. Keep your powder dry. Mind you, Dot Nut Pilgrim.